Islam and the Prophet are not represented by Saudi, nor by Iran, nor by any regime. Nor should you take its teachings from Bukhari or Aisha, the medieval ISIS queen. Our Prophet didn't marry Aisha at the age of six or nine. She was at least 18. This was only reported by Aisha and psychopaths always make up lies and fairy tales to turn their reality into a dream. Aisha was mentally unstable and instead of religious teaching she reported made up scenarios and 18 plus scenes. Taking her reports from Bukhari to judge our prophet is like judging America according to the sayings of Donald Trump or Charlie Sheen.
حاجة حسن مكي بس هاي تعال مني كذي يا علي ليه نسولف هذا الباب امي شوفي الباب انت الطاهر بس خلاص الله يا امامي انت الطاهر والحكمه يا امامي تقول ما كل العزاء هذه ما علي الله يا امامي انت الطاهر والتقوى الله يا امامي ليش من حبر ريحانه محمد لعن الله عمر زينب تصيح بقهر لعن الله عمر زينب تصيح بقهر لعن الله عمر زينب تصيح بقهر لعن الله عمر لا تنازل لا مفر لعن الله عمر لا تنازل لا مفر لعن الله عمر لا الله عمر لا تنازل لعن الله عمر للضلع هو كسر لعن الله عمر زينب تصيح بقهر لعن الله عمر زينب تصيح بقهر لعن الله زينب تصيح بقهر لعن الله عمر Take care after me of my sons Hassan and Hussein. Never yell at them, never shout at them. For it was only a few days ago they lost their grandfather Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alihi. And today they will lose me, their mother Fatima. Take care of them, for they have no one to turn to after me but you, Ya Amir al-Mu'mineen. And Amir al-Mu'mineen, alayhi salam, then left the house. Asma bint Umayyis says, I was with Fatima, salamullahi alayha. When she told me, Ya Asma, Ya, I will go rest for some time. And then call me if I respond, then it shall be so. But if I don't respond, be aware I have joined my father, Rasulullah, sallallahu alayhi wa alihi. Asma says, I sat down reading the Quran. After some time, I called her, Ya Mawlati, Ya Zahra, Ya, Ya, Ya. تقول ما أجابتني. She never replied back to me. I called her again, Ya Sayyidati, Ya Bint Rasul Allah, O daughter of the Messenger of Allah. She never responded back to me. I called her a third time, Ya Bint Man Salla, Bi Malaikat Al Sama, Ya. She never replied back to me. I went back to her room. I removed the cover from her face. I saw that Fatima has joined her father, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi. She says at that moment, Imam al Hassan and Imam al Hussein alayhim as salam came back to the house. Imam al Hassan asked me, Ya Asma, Aina ummuna Fatima. I didn't know what to tell him. What should I say to him? I told him, my Yabna Rasulullah, Sayyidi, your mother has gone in a long sleep. Leave her. He said, Ya Asma, this is not the time of sleep of our mother Fatima. He ran to her mother's room. He removed the cover. Then he cried, Akhi Hussein. Our mother has joined our grandfather Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi. 
ابن بيكران to the masjid of Rasulullah صلى الله عليه وآله crying and weeping Salman Saddam he said what is the matter O sons of Rasulullah صلى الله عليه وآله قال يا سلمان عجبا للسماء لم تنطبق على الأرض لقد ماتت أمنا فاطمة when Amir al Mu'mineen heard, he rushed back to the house crying, Aywa Fatima Taya, Inna Lillah, Wa Inna Ilayhi Raja'u. Sayyallamu al-Ladheen, Zalamu, Ayya Muntalabi, Yantalibun, Wal-Aqibatu lil-Muttaqeen.